We got new NBA 2K23 gameplay. You see it right here. A new trailer popped up. And we got to look at this trailer because it's still gameplay. Even though it's my team, I'm not going to lie. My team is looking fire this year. After seeing some of this, we all might need to give my team a chance. So I'm about to cover some things in my team while also showing y'all NBA 2K23 gameplay. Because you're seeing it right here in the background. You seeing the triple threats, you seeing the graph, you seeing the dunking, look at that, slashing on BOP. You see what I'm saying? We seeing all that. So let's go into it a little bit. My team has dropped a brand new mode. It's called Triple Threat Online Co-op. For the first time in my team, this brand new game will allow players to partner with their friends in a co-op 3v3 online across different variations. Party mode, co-op, and competitive online. Now I've been asking for this for years. And 2K finally did it. What is this, Jones? This is basically, you can control KD, I, I control LeBron, and Homeboy can control Shaq, and we gonna play against three other people on Triple Threat. That changes the game. Now it's like part. I've been wanting this mode for years. Now I might actually play it, because that's crazy. Basically, I'm about to break it down a little more, but it's park in my team that's very interesting. It's just like it. It's three on three. It's player locked. And we all get to play against other people, rank up and all that, bro. Like, that's kind of park related, bro. You know what I'm saying? You can be James Harden. I'm Kobe. And homeboy is AI. You know what I'm saying? We out here undefeated. Uh, basically, what's going to really happen, though, is I get Bobo. You get Taco Fall. And he get Yao Ming, and we gonna cheese with the seven seven demigods. That's what's really gonna happen. Let me break it down more. Triple Threat Online Co-op supports any combination of two to six players in the first time ever player locked gameplay in my team. If you choose which player call you want to use from the active lineup, if one of your friends in the group decides to play for the opposing team, you will automatically enter party mode. It doesn't matter if you're playing one on three, two on two, or two on three, or a full group of three on three. You can play however you like. The AI will fill out empty slots with the appropriate teammates as you and your friends play against each other. That's basically saying what I just said, just in detail. Expl basically explain, you can play with your homies, man. Y'all can literally rank up in my team online. You can also play against the bots and it's player lock. There's a player lock option where you basically will just be Shaq. He's, he's Damian Lillard right here, you know what I'm saying? And y'all in triple threat running it up. It's going to be real interesting. And there's no contracts. They took out contracts. For all y'all who play my team, you know how big that was. I even know, because I played my team many years and running out of contracts if you ain't buy packs with some cheese. So I'm really curious on how it's really going to go this year. My team looking kind of a W, I'm not going to lie. They doing they all in 2K23. But now, control any position. Triple Threat Online Co-op isn't the only mode in my team that allow position lock. For NBA 2K20, my team, we're making this change available to all modes. Whether you are used to a specific position or you just want to better manage a player's stamina on your way to competing in a gender requirement, you can now control a single position for an entire my team game. So now even 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 though you don't want to play triple threat, you can do it in every mode. You can do it in the full on 5v5. Y'all can play co-op mode. That's crazy. I ain't gonna lie. That's gonna bring more people to my team. Even people who play park, this is kind of relevant. And the reason it's relevant is because you're gonna get the same kind of, you know what I'm saying, same kind of park vibe type thing. It's three on three online, but it's just NBA players. So I think a lot of people are gonna like the end is player lock. So I think a lot of people actually gonna mess with this heavy, man. I actually think co-op is gonna be able to have its own little community inside of the my team community, not the normal my team. They're gonna be able to make a little new branch because you're gonna have best best player card lineups and you're gonna have certain things. This is gonna be cool for the my team YouTubers, man. Cause they got, man, my team got so much diversity on what they can post. They can go to 5v5. Now they can play with other content creators and collab and run this up. Or even if you play it in general and you're not a YouTuber, you can just play with more people now. It's not a single player mode. Cause my team's lack was always it's a single player mode. And no matter what, I mean, you couldn't really play with your friends. There was no way to do it, which is why I think that a lot of the park people really don't like it because they like multiplayer online playing with friends. 
since they solved this problem, I'm very curious how many of us are gonna convert to that side. Are we all gonna start giving it a try? Another mod I want to highlight was Clutch Town Single Player. Joining Triple Threat Online Co-op, we will be adding a new single player variant of the Clutch Time in NBA 2K23. Take your best starting five, compete against the AI for the first time in 2K22's hottest mode, structured in the same way as Clutch Time Online. The goal is to win 10 games in a tier without losing three in a row, gameplay remains fast paced in a single five minute quarter and a four point line in sudden death overtime, a 14 second shot clock. If you have yet to experience clutch times, you gotta check it out on 2K23's Mate. Now that kind of sounds interesting. Now I've never played clutch time and I don't really know what it is, but it looks very interesting. It looks like a little higher paced 3v3 sensation. It's like basically three on three all-star team up with a bunch of unique style of rules which is cool man you know what i'm saying like once again like y'all want new stuff too you know you want some og stuff splashing with some new stuff that's how they find out if you like it now i think this mode here to stay i think the co-op thing was smart very smart by 2k i don't i can't see anything wrong with them doing that they are definitely moving in the right direction with my team and converting park player because honestly my team makes the most money they want to convert as many Park My Career people over as possible because you're going to want to spend money on packs so you can get the new Diamond uh, Zion, you know what I'm saying, so you can take it to the Triple Threat Online. You see what I'm saying? You see how they doing now? If you get that one, I get that one, and you get that one, we can run it up, bro, and just get level 40 that way. And you can have agendas that are on the pause menu now, they said. The genders are now on the pause menu, so you ain't gotta go to the main thing no more. Now, for anybody who's still interested, I'm gonna play the full trailer with audio so y'all can hear the breakdowns a little bit better than me, and then I'll come right back. This is Josh Giddy, introducing you to NBA 2K23's My Team Mode. This year, take more control than ever before on your journey to assembling your very own dream team of the greatest NBA superstars. Let's take a look at what's coming to my team this year. Seasons are returning in my team with more ways to progress and earn incredible rewards in every game mode on your way to level 40 and beyond. And with new seasons every six weeks, my team is always staying fresh. With more ways for you to play and take control of your journey, let's hit the triple threat courts to see what's new. For the first time in my team, team up with your friends and your favorite cards in the brand new Triple Threat Online Co-op. Squad up with your friends to take on AI opponents to rise up your individual reward ladders or compete online to get great rewards as a team. You can even match up three on three in a party game for bragging rights. If you're going solo, Triple Threat gets new rewards for new and experienced players each season and Triple Threat Online returns to its classic roots in multiplayer action. Call in all weekend warriors. My Team Limited is a fun, online competitive mode with lineup requirements, requiring you to adapt and overcome each weekend with guaranteed rewards with every win. Clutch Time expands to both the multiplayer and single player experience. With a four point line, five minutes on the clock, and a 14 second shot clock, this high intensity and fast paced mode is like nothing else in NBA 2K. Unlimited returns. Take your best lineup and compete to increase your season's points and rise up the leaderboard. With even more rewards, prestiging, and competition, get ready to see how you rank against friends and the My Team community. New to 2K23's My Team? You can lock your control to a single player no matter if you are in domination, challenges, limited, or triple threat. Focus and compete how you want. Finally, contracts are gone. Play and use the cards in your collection how you want. There's more ways to play, earn, build and compete with your dream team in NBA 2K23, my team. If you're a my teammate, you want to read that in more detail, we'll have it in the description so you can go read it more in detail than I did it or that trailer show. But hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Let me know if y'all gonna try this new mode. I'm very curious that y'all gonna give it a shot. 
or you're not gonna do it, you're gonna go straight to the park and say forget my team. I'm curious because I think I will play some of this for me personally. But hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. To the next video, I see y'all there, man. Peace.